Hello YouTube and YouTube viewers, this is Cody Williams again, and today I'm going to show you guys a really fast, pretty easy stingray. I've never really been asked for one until a week ago in a restaurant, and I came up with this and I wanted to share it with you guys. So it should only take two grey 260s and a white and black round for the eyes. You can use an optional third grey 260 if you have a little trouble getting the end part, but we'll see if we can get by, if I can show you correctly, with just two. So first we're going to blow up both balloons equal length, each balloon's going to have about six fingers of a tail. And tie them separately. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna make a two-finger bubble followed by an ear twist. And you're gonna do this on both of your balloons. So we're gonna do a three-finger bubble and we're gonna attach this three-finger bubble to the ear twist of the other side. Now we're gonna do another three-finger bubble and we're gonna twist this into the ear twist on the other side. So it's kind of like starting a flat weave. So from here, you've got those two starting balloons and that little cluster junk we just made. So I'm gonna make a triangle with this balloon. So I'm gonna grab it and twist them together. And now I'm gonna make two ear twists at the same time by grabbing both these balloons, twisting them. I'm gonna isolate these two bubbles, lift it, and twist them both at the same time. From here, I'm going to send both of these balloons back up to the first ear twist on each side. So basically just doubling up that triangle that we have. I'll do this on both sides, like so. Now the rest of this, I'm going to give them kind of like those Stingray wings he has. By taking large loop twists on both sides, ending in the middle. The same thing on each side. Try and get them to be the same size if you can. Now here's where it's a little tricky. I'm gonna take the shorter one and I'm gonna leave it in the back for the actual stingray of the stingray. The stinger of the stingray. Oh, I'm gonna do little pinch twists on the bottom of these to make his wings a little more wingy. Now, for the rest of this, here's where you can either add a third grade 260 if you have a little trouble getting this final part, or you can do what I'm about to do. And it's, it's not too complicated to put enough air in it. So we're gonna do a three finger bubble, followed by an ear twist. And all we're gonna do is we're gonna loop this through the bottom. We're gonna stop right as that kind of wants to start going in, we're going to stretch this tail all the way to the back and catch it to the balloon first started. First started with that move, not first started. So, there we go. Okay, so from here, we're going to give him some eyeballs, and that's why this ear twist is here. So we're gonna get a black and white round for the googly eyes. So ready googly eyes, I get the white one about the size I wanna make his eyes. So half of this is each size of each eye. I like that. And now the black, we're gonna do half the size of the white for the pupils. Now I'm tying together. And we're gonna twist the black, sorry, twist the white in half. And twist the black in half into the white. This gives us good old fashioned googly eyes. Good. Now, all we're gonna do is we're gonna twist the eyes around this ear twist. Stay in frame. Trying to do this while keeping everything in the camera. It's a little tricky. I'm not sure I can. Okay. So what I like to do is I like to keep the gray in the middle on top. There we go. Like so. I should have unzoomed a little bit more. I could have more room to work with. Okay. So this gives me a really fast, really easy, two balloon and eyeballs stingray. 
and even flies really well. So, here is a stingray for restaurants or even lines. You guys have a great day today, a better tomorrow. Bless you guys, have fun, and I'll see you next time on YouTube. Thanks guys.